Palestine and the United Arab Emirates are back on the pitch for their second game at the AFC Asian Cup 2023 here at the El Janoub Stadium. For some, it's an ordinary match. For others, it's a somewhat politically charged match given the relations between the UAE and Israel. However, times have proven that the people's stances are not the same as their country's political stances. Let's see how the fans feel about the two countries facing each other tonight. It's an honor to play against the UAE. UAE and the Palestinians, we are all Arab, we are all brothers. We, are, we even share the same flag colors, everything. A long of history bond of our bond between us. At the end of the day, we're all Arab, we're all together. But I would love for my country to win, to be honest. love Palestine. Of course, free, free Palestine. The Emirati team were off to a great start at the AFCs this year with their 3-1 victory against Hong Kong China that raised their standing in Group C to second place after Iran. Palestine's Fida'i have also fought all odds to be here tonight in Doha with some of the players' minds stuck back home in Gaza where their friends and families are living under the ongoing Israeli genocide. So will tonight's game see Palestine bounce back after the previous loss against Iran? We'll have to see. The game was absolutely fantastic. It was a fantastic performance by uh, Palestine. I think they deserve to win today. But you know what? They won our hearts. Well, the game took an unexpected turn with a 1-1 tie between Palestine and the UAE. But regardless of tonight's score, Palestine has transcended all checkpoints, all obstacles to be here tonight at the AFC Asian Cup 2023 in Doha. Asmahan Karjuli, Doha News. Free, free, Palestine! Free, free, Palestine! Free, free!